Good day everyone, Captain Shiver here, Shiver Gaming. Welcome back to the channel. Figured I'd make a quick legendary fishing guide. Alright, for starters, I'm going to create this guide with the directions to get to every legendary fish from your farm. So, let's begin with the sprig legendary fish, which is the lake version, so... Just proceed north out of the farm. Alright, so the first legendary fish is located around this log. It's got a pretty high bite percentage. The name of the fish on the log is Legend. When fishing for Legend, you're going to have to have a fishing skill of 10. This can be achieved by using food buffs or lures or a combination or just being max base level. If you are max base level 10 already, then it still might be a good idea to be using a lure and some food buffs because Legend is difficult to catch. It's very erratic and all over the place. Looking at a map, you'll see our farm is over here and we went down this path over to the mountain lake and this is the only location to catch this fish. Uh, on this game file I have already caught it so I cannot catch it again but the easiest way to cast is to go up here to this point and cast straight down with a fishing rod not a sword. Throw it as far as you can and you should be able to get it within a couple of casts. Legendary fish are very erratic and they are easy to spot as legendary there will be a little green arrow above the legendary fish uh, when you hook it which isn't on any other types of fish. Alright the second fish that we will be going for is called the angler. To get to it you proceed straight to your right or east from your farm and through town you're gonna go right to the river Cross the bridge behind the Jojo Mart. And from this bridge, you cast directly up. You can catch it casting down as well. The angler is only available to be caught in fall. On a map, you'll see here's the farm and we just proceeded straight down here across the bridge and up and the bridge is located right there. Alright, next fish is the mutant carp. From your farm you can go there a couple of ways. Uh, I'm stuck in the trees. You can go through town or you can head straight south out of your farm to Marnie's farm and proceed to the right. You're going to want to try and get to the sewer. You can get there through the other way by the river as well. Just want to park your car right here. Jump in the sewer. And pretty much anywhere in here is fair game. The mutant carp is available in all seasons and is the only fish, legendary fish, that's available in all seasons. And looking at a map, your farm is here, you can take this route, you can take this route, or you can proceed down here and go in through the sewer pipe over here. Alright, Glacier Fish is our next fish on this guide. Once again, like the mutant carp, you'll head south out of your farm. And you can get there over that bridge or you can go around, I'm going around. Proceed across these bridges and basically from this point you'll want to cast straight south. The glacier fish is only available to be caught during the winter and it requires a fishing skill of 6 in order to be caught. Looking at the map you'll see our farm is here. And if you just proceed straight south to the left or west around to here, you'll be fishing off this little island. The last fish on the list is the crimson fish. This will make up all five of the legendary fish. 
Crimson Fish is located in the ocean. To get there, you're going to proceed to the right or east out of your farm, head through town, and head down to the beach. From the beach, make your way across the little bridge. And you're going to want to fish off of this dock right here, off the end. The crimson fish is only available to be caught in summer. The crimson fish requires a skill level of 5 to be caught. And you can get there with any of the fish that I've mentioned a skill level on, you can get there by using tackle. So you don't have to have a base of 5, but you can get there with buffs. Looking at a map, we're at the beach here. My face is completely in the wrong spot. We're actually located over here at the end of this pier and we got there from our farm up over here so you can proceed a number of ways I went through town this way that's it for the crimson fish and that's my fishing guide thank you everyone for taking the time out of your day to watch and I really appreciate your support if you enjoyed what you saw uh, please feel free to subscribe or uh, or click the like button um, as well if uh, you want to see future episodes or follow my playthrough uh, on my new Stardew Valley farm then please hit the bell notification so you're notified whenever there's a new episode thank you everyone and have a good day